What can you catch but not throw? Clue 1. You might find yourself with this, especially in colder seasons. Clue 2. It's something you'd rather not have, but it's easily shared among friends and family. Clue 3. It's not tangible, yet it can lay you low and demand rest. Isn't it peculiar how some things are caught without any physical effort? If you've ever been under the weather, you might already know the answer. Ready to find out, it's a cold, despite its name, it has a way of spreading warmth through care and concern from those around us. What has a ring but no finger? Clue 1. It's often heard at the beginning and end of a conversation. Clue 2. It can be found in homes and offices, alike. Clue 3. It's a means of communication, though not as popular as it once was. A bit of a throwback, isn't it? This object has been a centerpiece of communication for decades. Have you guessed it yet? Let's ring in the answer. It's a telephone, an essential device that, despite the rise of smartphones, still holds its place in many settings. I fly without wings. I cry without eyes. Wherever I go, darkness flies. What am I? Clue 1. I'm seen more during turmoil and less on peaceful days. Clue 2. I can be both a symbol of mourning and a natural phenomenon. Clue 3. I'm associated with clouds but not limited to them. This one flutters through the air, carrying weight that's both literal and metaphorical. What could be light enough to fly yet heavy enough to bring darkness? Time to reveal. It's smoke, rising and spreading, it's a harbinger of change. Often signaling the presence of fire or the remnants of what once was. What begins and ends with an E but only contains one letter? Clue 1. It's something you might receive in the mail, but it's not a package. Clue 2. It's used for communication, often carrying words of love, congratulations, or sympathy. Clue 3. It's a paper product, but not a book or a magazine. A little wordplay for you, wrapped in an envelope of mystery. Think outside the box, or should we say, inside the envelope? Let's unseal the answer. It's an envelope, a container of words and emotions, beginning and ending with E, yet it holds within it a message, a single letter. I am not alive, but I grow. I don't have lungs, but I need air. I don't have a mouth, but water kills me. What am I? Clue 1. I'm often seen in the aftermath of a celebration or a festive event. Clue 2. I can be a symbol of joy and a tool for decoration. Clue 3. I come in many colors and sizes, but I always rise to the occasion. This one might have you floating in a sea of thoughts, looking for the buoyant answer. What rises without life, celebrating in silence? Ready for the pop of revelation. It's a balloon, filled with air or helium, it grows and soars, adding color to our lives, yet vulnerable to the simplest elements like water.